Yo, what's going on guys? So today, uh, we are at the airport. To give you guys perspective, it is 4.14. Um, I woke up at 3 in the morning because I had to get here with Andres to catch his flight. Well, it's kind of annoying. I have been walking around this airport for like literally 20, 30 minutes. Just like back and forth, back and forth. And apparently the check-in desks don't open until two hours before the flight. So, yeah, I have to wait, but I, my, I literally had to use, like, probably the most French I've ever used just in this one airport to, like, get around and ask everyone questions on, like, where everything is, and everyone just keeps pointing me to, like, different people. So, I think I finally got to figure it out. Can, can you guys see that peaking right there? Yo, look at that menu. That is the last time I will ever see that, therefore I am copying. And you may ask, Gavin, why are you possibly getting a coffee? I thought you just said you were really tired and you were gonna sleep on the plane. Well, um, due to my calculations that I have now assessed, um, currently it is 1021 in Miami. I don't know if you can see that. So, therefore, if it's 1021 in Miami, which is six hours behind here, and I get to London at 7, oh wait, I get to London 7.35 London time, which is, wait, I'm confused. The way I'm going to do this is I'm going to sleep on my second plane, but not on this plane. Alright, well I'm going to use some sleep no matter what, because that flight is long and I need it to pass by fast. So, I'm really going to make myself as tired as possible, but I need to keep myself awake for that time. So, the only way that's going to happen is, uh with that beauty over there that you guys can't really see because it's out of focus. So, right now, getting the croissant, I will update you on how that is in a second, but it's in my hands. That's one beautiful croissant and a fucking espresso because, uh, some people love to do a fucking cafe over here. Mm. It's just to give you guys an idea how much I'm feeling for the fucking Fortnite, I can't, I can't stop watching. Also, this coffee is literally darker than, like, the fucking Arabic coffee that I have back then. Oh, I'm gonna it to the dome real quick. So cheeks, all right. It's currently 4.45, so we're gonna whip it to the freaking check-in, and then we're gonna get on our plane, but I'm officially woke. So it's good. What would be a day without bomb searching? What would be a day? I actually wondered. Um, 510. So weird. I don't know why, but like, everything's available at certain times here. Like, you're not allowed to check your bag in between, or before two hours, and then you can't see where the gate is until an hour before. It's really weird, yeah, but. Chilling at Starbucks, and uh, who knows? My cop another coffee. I don't know. We might fiend out today because it's gonna be a long day. I got 14 hours ahead of me when it comes to flying. So, uh, bon voyage. My friend is actually low key gas right now, and the fact that I have to leave it's kind of a bummer. Me, me, Taylor, and Chloe sat in my room last night and. Kind of just talk about everything, like how we're all kind of sad to be leaving. At the same time, we're happy to be going. Chloe's going to Italy, but me and Taylor are going back home today. It's all kind of surreal. Like Leon offered so many things to us, just like little moments, like opening my window, seeing that view every night, passing by the train every morning, getting on the tram, I'm um, walking through the streets. There are all these crazy things that we would just see every day that we're not going to see anymore. So, yeah, kind of kind of surreal sitting here in the airport about to leave a French-speaking country and go back into an English one because I'm my connecting flight's in London. So, I will see you guys when I touch down in London. So, currently we are in London right now. There's a bunch of shops over here. Right now I need to figure out what I'm going to eat. I need to figure out... Yeah, how to get to my gate. But otherwise it was pretty fucking easy. And uh, 
Oh, you got me a chicken and this for the one time, but I'll update you when I get my food. And they also have a caffeine arrow here, which I have in Boston, so it might be just a drug myself with caffeine today to stay awake for about 16 hours, but yeah, that's probably the move for today. This one all has Louis and Bulgari. Like, this is insane. Oh shit, now I don't know where I'm going. Alright, we're gonna head over here and check. I got a uh, chocolate almond croissant, uh, some mozzarella sandwich and a water, and this is gonna be my pre-game snack for this long ass flight. So I'm gonna go fucking delete this food and get back to the vlog in a bit, please. Okay, so now we are back in a familiar place uh, with Peanut here. Obviously, I'm in my room. I literally just got done working out, and I made myself part of this. It's ghost coffee ice cream with, like, low-fat peanut butter and bananas and milk. Really a fire combination, but I got a few gifts waiting for me back here, which is cool. So, I got this red Gymshark. I think it's a, is it a t-shirt? Hold up for a second. I don't know. Is it a t-shirt or a cutoff? Okay, t-shirt. Then I got a light blue cutoff. Then I got this new razor. So I don't know if you guys know, but like I shave my legs so and my arms and whatever, but I get these razor burns. So to prevent that, I've read a bunch of articles reading that this is like perfect for that because it doesn't really cut as close to the skin. Um finally I got this for peanut. I don't know if you can see this little like Wait, hold on. This little dog headbands from Junk. I also got one on right now. I got like, I think it's like a white camo or something. I don't know if you guys can see that, but yeah, I'm gonna be rocking this for a little bit. <sighs> so yeah, and now we're gonna run to some fort and just vibe, but I am super tired. I was like hallucinating. I drank so much caffeine just to stay awake so that my sleep schedule can be fixed. And like, the fact that I'm even vlogging right now is insane, but uh, yeah, that, that's the update for right now. Happy to be back here. Happy to have all my stuff together. And uh, of course, you know, happy to be a little sis. Oh, and Darren's in the other room, but. Yeah, that is it for now. Pina, you wanna finish off the vlog? <laughs> like, comment, um, subscribe, and do what you wanna do. And then, that. <laughs> and that's a wrap.